We begin with that huge announcement in Kansas where a $4 billion plant is coming to DeSoto. Governor Kelly just made the announcement within the hour. Panasonic will build batteries for Tesla's electric cars at the old Sunflower Ammunition Plant. KMBC 9's Michael Mahoney is back to fill us in. Michael? Chris, this could change DeSoto for generations, literally. It's going to bring 4,000 good paying jobs to the area. And you might remember that this started as the secret mega deal last winter in Topeka. State lawmakers were asked to approve a billion dollars in tax breaks, but very few of them knew what the project was at the time. Now we do. A $4 billion Panasonic investment. News Chopper 9 went over the future site today, again at the old Sunflower Ammunition Plant in DeSoto. This will be Panasonic's second Tesla battery plant in the United States, the other one's in Texas. And when lawmakers agreed to this back in the winter and Governor Kelly signed the deal, she called this a once in a generation opportunity. A new facility of this size is transformational, not only for Johnson County, but also for the surrounding area, and actually the entire state. In addition to the 4,000 new jobs from Panasonic, an estimated 4,000 more jobs will be created by suppliers and businesses throughout the region. That's a total of 8,000 jobs coming to Kansas. The governor says this was also going to produce another 500 million in yearly income to Kansas workers as Panasonic picks DeSoto as the site of a new battery plant for Tesla's electric vehicles. 